Yes. Operation Who's Your Daddy. The top mission is finding dad. Submission is going to be having stone crabs. Mission below that, getting you laid. I know that all too well from growing up with my two brothers, but um, it's interesting you mentioned those twin moments. I was very curious about those and would try to, I don't know if I was getting into character, but, you know, I encouraged Ed, you know, anytime you get a feeling or... You know, if something you know strange, just call me. You know, Let's maybe see it's happening if, to yeah, me. Yeah, see if we're having the same one. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, we did, you know, sync up a couple of times. You know, there was one day you showed up and you were hungry, and I was like, "Son of a gun, I'm starved <laughs> too." Monogamy wasn't exactly a priority. <laughs> I've always wondered where I got my zest for love making. Now we know. You have to just be real buddies for you it do. to work. Right? Chemistry. Chemistry is yeah. important. And you can't, you know, you can't manufacture it. You can't bottle it and try to use it on another movie. You got to just get in there, roll up your sleeves, spend some time with the other person and see if, uh, if there's any magic. And thank God <laughs> um, when I uh, teamed up with this guy, it was just like... Uh, Sparks flew. Right. Yeah. You're seeing it now. I don't have to tell you that. <laughs> Mom actually dated Carrie Bradshaw? Do you remember a woman named Helen Baxter? Talk about a blast from the past. She had the tightest ass you've ever seen. A mouth. And that tongue. And a set of knockers. <laughs> Damn near cost us the Super Bowl. She's our mom. There was a lot of improv. I mean, Cat Williams uh, can only be described as an improvisational wizard. That's true. But uh, <laughs> he he was just, like, you just never knew what was going to come next with him um, in the best way. Just a, a lot of fun. And then Owen and I would usually just be sort of like yakking over at craft service about some dumb thing, trying to crack each other up, and Larry would overhear and be like, put that in the movie. And so we would yeah. do it and we'd improvise all this stuff. And it was probably think... less a case of Larry overhearing it more that Larry was trying to get a snack and we'd sort of corner <laughs> yeah. Larry. Hey, listen, listen to this. Listen to this. We just came We're up. We're talking about dried yeah. apricots. It's hilarious. <laughs> you got to put this in the movie. What are you doing here? We think we're your sons. Excuse me for a minute. There is no way those two jackasses are my kids. He runs hot, just like you. So let's be clear, he's Larry to me. He'll never be Lawrence. I'm never going to call that guy Lawrence. Uh, but I, I realize as a director, he has to be Lawrence now. But yeah. um, it's, it, it, was, uh, <laughs> it was awesome to see Larry kind of stretch it. Stretch his wings out and and uh, get his get wings and fly. Yeah, get nudged out of the out yeah. of the nest and catch some yeah updraft and just yeah. soar like an eagle. <laughs> yeah. Does the name Helen Baxter ring a bell? It does more than ring a bell. She was like a sexual ninja. She's our mom. All we did was cuddle.